Hello YouTube, today I finally there's some quiet time for me, so let's get rolling until the painting like starts again. Okay, so when so this video is about how to make a uh, falling letters intro. So it is actually very easy. So when you open your small 4D, yeah, it's opened on me. So then you go to your here and go to output, change this to 1280 and this 720 uh -huh. then go to um, save and go to Tiff and go to Avi movie then save it wherever you want I'll just save it here like falling high falling high I'll just do this uh, okay when you've done that you can move out and get ready and go to light get to floor Accordance, I hope it is it. Nine, full of nine. So it likes, I just like it. Okay, when you've done that, go to your MoGraph, Mo text. Uh, write in anything you want. Like, I'll just write in, um, hi. Hmm, and pick your font. I actually want to pick this. It looks cool. Nah. Okay. So whenever you pick your font, it cannot be like this kind of font. What? It can't be like this. You like see all of them over here? Yeah. When the fuck. When the intro will be like when they will be falling down, it will bounce off them and it does not look cool. So let's go back to our little font. And yeah. We have that and we want to add in some light like I'll just copy and copy so I just need a lot of it so there will be a lot now I'll just spread it up like that and there go to more text depth like add in any depth you want okay there that's it now when we have that, mm -hmm. now double click here like always and pick your color. I'm just gonna put white uh, reflection. Yeah, stay white. Put it down to 50. This will be for the floor. Put it under. So we have a nice. It looks nice. Okay, then we want to pick the color for our. Okay, so I'll just um, put this and I'll load an image. So if you want to load an image, you turn off your color if you want. It will like mix with the picture. So then go to texture, load image, and look for it. Like can you? And wherever you have it, I'll just there. That's a cool one. I love it. Yeah. So it looks like that. I'm just gonna put on the high. It looks black, but it will look like this. If we want two images, like I will just do, just when you select your second, just put on the mode text like that, and you see that, and click on the color. It's, but it has to be forced. Then write in a selection B C and one. So it will just look like this. Oh uh, no. There. Ah, fuck that. Okay. When you've that done, just highlight the floor and the mold text. And like, no, not the floor, not the floor, just the mold text. Put it up in the air. Like, wherever you want to put it. Now, go to highlight the floor and the text and right click in Dynamics Tags and Dynamics Spot. So, whenever you play it now, hmm. I can over in a random like hit. You can change it by going to dynamics and collision and like box. There's different ones, some different ones like boom, I fell over like that. Accelerate. Then a little bounce up. Yeah, I'll say with that. Then we'll go to let's put up. Go to our camera. 
like always hit this white thing here and go to cameras scene camera camera now the camera sees what we see and this is what we want to so pick the mode text like down to zero zero yep uh, now put it yeah just gotta do, go to zero and keyframe key yep so it starts here and wherever does it end fuck okay it will end just on 60 yeah yeah so put it, the keyframe like that keyframe and add in some keyframes so frames yeah and put it up up to up to I'll just put it to 120 and I'll just do this that's it I still have a lot of time so I'll just, just there so like let's do let's see like what the fuck or oh, the camera wasn't like in there don't know why but okay mm -hmm. dun, 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 dun. Say, 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 and epic fail. So, yeah, well, whenever you've that done, like, you don't need to record it. It's like, there. So, whenever you've that done, yeah, I forgot about what I was doing. Uh, the last keyframe was, uh, Okay, it starts over here. Yep. Then we'll put it up to 60 where it ends. Yep. Keyframe. And put it on to 100. Uh -huh. Okay, just. Uh huh. Now I'll put it to 100 and spread it out. Huh. I'm just gonna do that. It's the old fashioned way. <laughs> and it's like that. And just. Boom. That's it. So this, and then you go to the middle one. What? Just gotta check everything. Go to. Oh, there. Go to best. Go to anti aliasing and animation. 2x2. Two two, main level. Yeah, and main max level options. Okay. 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 Okay, and then um, go to this again and go to output and change this to zero. And whenever what whatever frame does this end on, just put it there. Yep. So this frames, yeah, it ends a uh, frame of one hundred. So we don't want like extra seconds. There. Then the middle one and like rendering and all of that. So yeah, this is it. And oh yeah, and oops, and this is like this will happen. It's not you cannot open it yet because it is still rendering. So whenever it's gonna finish, it just come up will come up like this. It's the rendering thing. Oops, that's not yet. No, it's project. Okay, so this will be pretty. See you.